Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you three keyboard shortcuts to shut down and restart Windows 11. And this also works with previous versions of Windows. Now there are multiple ways to shut down and restart your Windows computer. Windows is the only operating system that offers many ways to turn off the computer. Out of all these options to shut down and restart your Windows 11 or Windows 10 computer, using keyboard shortcuts to turn off your computer is the easiest way out there. But there is no direct keyboard shortcut to shut down or restart your Windows computer. That being said, I will show you some ways to use your keyboard and shut down or restart a computer. The first method is to press Windows logo key and X key at the same time and it will open the start button context menu. Press the U key to expand the shutdown or sign out menu. From here, you can press the U key again to shut down and the R key to restart your computer. You can also use the up and down arrow keys to select an option and then press the enter key. The second method is to use Alt F4 to shut down or restart Windows 11 or the previous versions of Windows. First, you will minimize the running programs using Windows logo key plus M key and then press Alt plus F4 to open the classic shutdown Windows dialog box. By the way, if you press Alt plus F4 when any of the program is opened and active on the screen, then Windows will close that particular program. So that's why you need to minimize all the running programs. Now with this shutdown Windows dialog box, you can use the up and down arrow keys to select the shutdown or restart options from the drop down. After selecting the appropriate options, you can either restart or shut down the windows. The final method that I'll show you is not really a combination of keyboard shortcuts. Instead, it is a shortcut file that you can create on your desktop and run the windows shutdown or restart command with the shortcut file. So first, I will create a shortcut file on my Windows 11 desktop by right clicking on the desktop select new and select shortcut in type the location of the item field i will type shutdown.exe minus s which will shut down the computer or shutdown minus r which will restart the computer i will keep the shutdown.exe minus r and click next to continue in the type a name for this shortcut field you can type shutdown or restart depending on what you have selected in the previous step. I will type restart because I have specified the restart command in the previous step. Click on the finish button to create a shutdown or restart shortcut on the desktop. Now if you double click on this, it will restart or shut down your computer based upon the command that you have typed. I will abort this by going to run window and typing shutdown minus A. But if you right click on the newly created restart shortcut on the desktop and then click properties, under the shortcut tab, select the field next to the shortcut key by clicking on it and then press a letter that you would like to use as a shortcut to shut down or restart your computer. Just so you know, Windows will prefix Ctrl plus Alt to the selected letter. For instance, if you have typed S key, Ctrl plus Alt will be automatically prefixed to it. So the keyboard shortcut becomes Ctrl plus Alt plus S. Once done, click on apply button to save the new shortcut. Save your work and see if your newly created shortcut works. Also deleting the shutdown or restart shortcut from desktop will disable the keyboard shortcut that you have specified. So you cannot use that key combination to shut down or restart your computer. So these are the three ways to restart or shut down your computer using keyboard shortcuts. I hope you like this video. For more videos like these, please subscribe to my channel.